Hello everyone, today I'll show you how to create this pencil effect column chart in Excel. I will use very simple method and basic designing skills in this chart so that anyone can make it easily. The chart is fully dynamic and best fit for any dashboard and presentation. So let's start. First of all, select the data by which you want to create the chart. Go to insert, chart and select this 2D column chart. Remove the chart titles, grid lines and all the axes. Now go to format data series and reduce the gap width to 0% so that there are no gaps between the columns. Now resize it. and remove the outline. Go to insert illustrations and bring this triangular shape so that it looks like a pencil. Now reposition it and make one more copy of this and place it at the bottom. Change the fill color to black. Now select this one. And here I'll give a gradient color so that it's look like a pencil. In the middle, the color will be little darker. And in the right side and left side, it will be lighter. I'll give no line. Now it's looking like a pencil. Now I'll change the color of the line. First one, I'm giving a dark red. Second one, I'm giving a dark blue color. And third one, green color. Now again, go to illustration, shape, and bring this shape. And place it here. Make two more copies. And change the color respectively with the column. So it will look more like a pencil. So our pencil designing part is done. Now I'll bring a shape for the data. I'll change the color and for outline I'll give the weight to 6 pd. Now make three more copies and change the color. Now I'll link the shapes with the data. I'll do same for all the shapes. I'll design the shapes. I'll change the font color and font size. Then I'll go to illustration shapes and I'll bring this shape. And I will continue this. After that, it will look like this. Then I will bring another shape. It is for title. I will copy this and I will paste it. And I will change the color respectively with the shapes. And I'll copy this shape for a master title. Now select all the shape and make it a group, give a shadow effect, and our chart is done. This is all about this video. If you have enjoyed the video, then don't forget to subscribe our channel and check out our other series for more attractive chart and dashboard videos.